Good morning, children. Then, class students, let us continue with the chapter that is globalization. Okay, today we are going to complete this chapter. Okay, uh, I am repeating the last line which we had written around 1991. Important changes were made in Indian economy. The government realized that competition improves the performance of the producers and their standard. Full stop. Till here we had done. Continue after that, after the full stop, same point. This was supported by, this was supported by World Trade Organization and IMF. World Trade Organization and IMF. Full stop. Thus, barriers on foreign trade, thus barriers on foreign trade and investment were removed to a large extent, were removed to a large extent and foreign companies and foreign companies were allowed to set up were allowed to set up factories and offices factories and offices in India, in India, full stop, next point, removing trade barriers, removing trade barriers on import and export on import and export is known as liberalization is known as liberalization full stop next heading world trade organization world trade organization in bracket right wto Set up in 1995. Set up in 1995. Comma headquarters in Geneva. In Geneva. Full stop. WTO was started. WTO was started at the initiative of of developed nations of developed nations nations for a dash is an international is an international organization is an international organization to liberalize international trade to liberalize international trade Full stop. 2016. 2016. 
2016 it had 196 member countries it had 196 member countries member countries full stop next point wto was supposed to allow wto was supposed to allow to allow free trade to all but it is biased but it is biased towards developed nations towards developed nations full stop they have retained trade barriers they have retained trade barriers comma wto rules wto rules have forced have forced under developed nations under developed nations nations to open their economies to open their economies and remove trade barriers and remove trade barriers remove trade barriers full stop currently next point currently wto's impact wto's impact on agriculture on agriculture is discussed and criticized is discussed and criticized full stop next right heading impact of globalization impact of globalization first point consumers consumers there is greater choice for consumers there is greater choice for consumers who now enjoy who now enjoy improved quality improved quality and lower prices of products lower prices of products full stop second point right producers and workers underline it producers and workers mnc basically is interested mnc basically is interested in industries like cell phones in industries like cell phones comma soft drinks comma automobiles comma fast food banking services and are actually and are actually 
benefiting urban areas urban areas and well of buyers well of buyers for whom new jobs and services new jobs and services have been created full stop next point several top indian companies several top indian companies have also benefited have also benefited from increased competition from increased competition from a new technology from a new production methods because of because of several collaborations several collaborations full stop next point indian companies have emerged indian companies have emerged as multinational companies example tata motors tata motors comma ran backsi infosys asian paints etc next point globalization has also created globalization has also created new opportunities for it companies it companies example in data entry in data entry comma accounting accounting comma engineering engineering etc etc which are done cheaply which are done cheaply and exported to develop nations exported to develop nations full stop write it down small producers small producers just write the subheading small producers and the next point globalization has been a challenge for them globalization has been a challenge for them as they might either compete they might either compete or perish or perish full stop they have been hard hit they has been hard hit by competition and several unit several units have shut down have shut down rendering R E N D E R I N G rendering 
many workers jobless many workers jobless example next line read example mnc in a garment industry mnc in a garment industry employed workers not on permanent basis not on permanent basis but temporarily comma so benefits of organized sector benefits of organized sector are not given full stop during peak season comma workers work overtime workers work over time so mnc can make huge profits so mnc can make huge profit but workers are denied a fair share of profit a fair share of profit as they are working on a temporary basis as they are working on a temporary basis full stop next right heading struggle for fair globalization struggle for fair globalization f a i r fair just first point not everyone is benefited not everyone is benefited from globalization from globalization comma people with education comma skill and wealth and wealth have benefited full stop continue since globalization is a reality since globalization is a reality pura dash question is question is how to make globalization more fair how to make globalization more fair comma so it can create opportunities so it can create opportunities and benefits for all question is how to make globalization more fair so it can create opportunities and benefits for all full stop next point in this regard in this regard government can play government can play a major role a major role to make policies comma to protect the interest of all to make policies continue now don't put a comma to make policies to protect the interest of all comma labor laws should be implemented properly labor laws should be implemented properly next point workers should get all the rights workers should get all the rights all the rights comma support should be given 
support should be given to small producers comma if necessary if necessary government must use trade and investment barriers trade and investment barriers or negotiate with wto or negotiate with wto for fairer f a i r e r fairer fairer rules full stop next point massive campaigns massive campaigns c a m p a i g n s campaigns comma no not comma and representation by people's organization representation by people's organization have influenced have influenced important decision of wto important decisions of wto this shows full stop this shows people's struggle people's struggle for for fair globalization for fair globalization and can help greatly and can help greatly okay we are going to stop over here children this completes your economic portion of your entire syllabus okay consumer awareness is not coming the next two chapters will be taken by santosh sir that is manufacturing industries and the last that is lifelines of indian economy any confusion you can always ask me in the doubt classes is that clear just now in the next next class i'll be giving you all the map list so that in your holidays you can prepare the map